Hello, and welcome back to Caves of Cud. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. Um, we completed our quests in Jopa, all of them actually. Now that I, now that I think a bit, a bit too famished. Um, we have to start making some recipes. That's what we gotta do. That's what we gotta do. Let's preserve our fresh foods. Can we preserve some fresh foods? We could preserve that yonder cane. That sounds good. Could also preserve some salve. Why not? Uh, one salve. And we'll choose some ingredients. We're gonna choose, well, I don't know, a dram of, of honey and some salve. Let's, let's try that. Plus three to saves versus disease. Plus 10 to 15 percent to natural healing rate. Nice. I, I le learned to cook e cats honey salve loaf. There we go. New recipe. We have a new recipe. Uh, not sure how many more recipes I need to make. I'm gonna have a quick look. Just to just to be sure. Uh, not that it's important, but it's you know interesting. I have created 63 recipes, so I have another 37 to go in case, you know, math is a trouble spot. Um, so we're going to go to uh, Gridgate and uh, just, you know, get that started. No, never mind. We're going to get lost in the canyons. Oh, hey, hey, Sightless Way. Um, they got they got mirrored. That was kind of nice. I'm going to go ahead and dominate them. I was, I'm wondering if I could, like, sunder my own mind as the uh, servant of the Sightless Way and then get that achievement. We can see how long my domination will last and how long their sunder mind will last. So can we dominate ourselves or sunder our own mind? Looks like no, we can't. Oh, are you sure you want to sunder your own mind? Yes. Uh, it doesn't really work. Okay. So we're just going to go ahead and make enemies to a honey skunk and then die. Sounds good to me. And, you know, things are... Oh, there's another one over there. Let's uh, let's go ahead and laze them to death. I suppose what we could do is uh, dominate another... If there's another sightless way, probably there will be, um, you know, towards uh, Great Gate. Is we can dominate something uh, very weak-minded and die as them to the sightless way that would be that would make things easier ah oh, we're inspired let's go ahead and cook some more food i do need some some star apple jam i want to uh co ooh, 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 ooh. common mistake I, I tend to make is to uh not work on making a disease saving uh recipe like the sooner you get working on that the better because sometimes you can get really unlucky and it just ends up you know not happening for a long time and sometimes ever um so do we we have a gun now we don't have a gun because we don't have bullets um this is a this is a lot of baboons i wonder we wouldn't die to a red rock hazing ritual over here would we okay let's go ahead and rest oh we're bleeding are we still bleeding? Okay, we're no longer bleeding. Let's go ahead and wait. And we'll continue fighting baboons. Why not? We're still... Oh, we're not lost anymore. Okay, well, we are inspired. Why don't we go ahead and cook another meal? Can't cook with hostiles nearby. I mean, I really refuse to believe that there are hostiles nearby. But anyway, choose ingredients. We do have some star apple jam and we have some vine wafer sheaf. So we're going to go ahead... Uh, I guess we can cook with one more thing, but I, I want to cook with those two things. I feel like the cooking um, UI has been improved somewhat. One toughness for the rest of the day. Uh, whenever you drink fresh water, there's a 25% chance one of your negative status effects is removed at random. That is exactly the recipe we want. And I got very, very lucky with our first recipe being the one that I needed. So that is very nice. I'm very, very happy about that. I really just don't ever, ever want to have to deal 
with um, Glot Rot or uh, Iron Shank or any of those. I don't know if we have Iron Shank. I should check real quick. Iron Shank. Uh, I do believe I have gotten that. I got it in 2020, apparently. Have I contract Iron Shank? Did I cure Iron Shank, though? Cure Iron Shank. Yes, I also did that in 2020. Makes sense to me. Makes sense that I would have done those two things uh, in in uh, chronological order in the same year. You know, after all, um, it's it's pretty easy to do the other once the first has happened, and it's also very likely. When you think about it, you're much more likely to want to cure Iron Shank after you've contracted it. Um, take a weird artifact. We've got some weird artifacts. We've got some studded leather armor. What are we using right now? Steel plate. Steel plate's pretty good. AV5 is a is a good number. Oh no. Okay, well they got they got uh, mirrored. So what we want to do is we want to run away. Oh, there's a nice chest over there. Let's sprint. I'm gonna sprint over here. And I'm gonna look for something to dominate. So that I can um well you know the rest. We're gonna we're gonna look for something I can dominate so I can I can die to the novice of the sightless way. Die to a good old sunder. Oh cannibal, perfect. Now I'm just gonna lure you over here so I get the most out of this domination. Okay. Alright, Mr. Cannibal. You are going to be my little puppet. Oh, I just um might have made the mistake of my can the cannibal doesn't really have any any way of seeing also i'm having some interface problems i've been doing a lot of uh like you know messing around with the interface so that i can uh i can make the, my my options um tutorial and unfortunately it's kind of uh, messed me up a little bit so let me let me let's try this again. Nope, it's still not working. Can we zoom out? I guess we can, but now my <laughs> my menu is gone. Okay, how about now? Oh, there we go. There we go. Um, so I need a torch. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, make the make the text bigger again. Now that I figured out, I think it was zoomed in slightly. I'm I'm stuck. I need a torch. Someone, someone get me a torch. I think our novice of the site this way is down here. If I can just like find them. Small stone, ashes. I should have uh, dropped a torch. I, I didn't realize our cannibal was blind. Uh, they're not blind. It's just, it's nighttime. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to come back over here. Was that, was there something good in there? No, there's no torch. Damn. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to come back over here just slightly and then, oh, okay. Day, day two, I was going to, I was going to say we were going to try. Oh no, the goat's fighting the sightless way and they killed him. No. Well, I guess I'll end domination. Stupid goat. Goat, why'd you have to ruin my day? I was gonna die as a seeker of the site uh, as a as a cannibal. I, I know it's an odd goal, but I I was gonna do it. Lead slug. Oh, I mean, two a lead slug is better than none. Oh, there's also a iron buckler. Now, there's been I've been chatting with someone uh, in the comments about shields. Oh, we can't. We really cannot be picking up like anything. Um, shields is one of those things that I've often had trouble with and, uh, even found myself in like, I wouldn't say arguments, but like in conflict, like, how does it work? How do shields work? Um, do they work when you wield them? Mm, the consensus I believe is that you can only wield buck or you can only we wield heavy shields, any, anything, um, like a buckler if it if it if it's a buckler it can go on your arm and it works the same as any other shield why do we have to keep finding secrets of the sightless way when I, there are no creatures around for me to die to die as 
is a crab. Um, so bucklers are the only shield that can go on your arm, I believe. Uh, also, I guess ronders. I, I can't remember. Silver ronders, I think, can go on your arm. I don't know. There's a, you know, there's a, there's a few things here that I, I, I'm not really clear on. Um, but shields are very good for providing extra um, protection. However, they're kind of a risk-based thing. Um, they they have they only have a chance of providing AV, as I understand it. Um, and I don't know if that that is like the chances are increased if you uh, if you have multiple shields. Like it's just one of those things. I don't get it. I don't understand. I'm 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 kind of ignorant on this whole topic. Uh, I'd like to do a whole video about shields. Once I actually have like some like truly, um, you know, I, I have it all figured out. Can we prosthetize this lad? Yes. Oh. All right. Well, I mean, I, I guess our my my journey of getting teleported randomly is ongoing. Um, a little bit concerned. I think that our Quillipede, yeah, um, just died to a Slumberling. And that's a problem because now the Slumberling is alive. Here he comes. Here, here he comes, the lad. Um, this is what we're going to do. Never, we're going to die is what we're going to do. Thanks a lot, the Quillipede. I mean, I guess thanks a lot, me, for making the mistake of making friends with a quillipede that did not do anything for me actually because it just flung me several uh layers below the earth it's another portal where I, i'm i i am questioning the um safety of quantum jitters for sure quantum jitters i think is mostly a bad thing <laughs> i don't think i've actually benefited from it at all I, I don't think that I, I have gotten like a single good thing out of quantum jitters except for the uh, I think was it four extra mutation points in the beginning uh, for sure I appreciate those extra four uh, points but just dang you know like just dang it, it, it's been kind of a trial wow that didn't work at all um, if I proselytize are we gonna have the same business happen Wow. Wow, crab, huh? Wow, crab, huh? All right, I'm going to sprint away and then we're going to laze them. Okay. <sighs> Quantum jitters really, really has been a, a pain in the butt. But, you know, uh, every time I accidentally get flung through space into, uh, into a random location and cut, it does... It, you know, eke us closer towards another achievement. So, uh, in, in that in that sense, it is serving a purpose. It makes it more interesting to me. You know, like if I just took the uh, time space vortex mutation, like the ability to create them on command, then it would just be me like making portals occasionally. And, and yeah, I mean, like it would be very intentional and be like, okay, well, my time vortex thing is off cooldown. I got. I guess I'm making another one, and we're gonna go. To some random location. It'd be very much like the clams. I like the clams a lot, but the achievement to go, you know, jump through a hundred clams, uh, I think right now is actually not very interesting. Reason being is that all of the clams are in Lake Hinnom and the Palladium Reef. There no, th there's no other clams as far as I know in like other interesting places. I could be wrong about that. I'm probably wrong. I'm usually wrong when it came, comes to cut. You know, like, uh, I, I generally don't know better than uh, the, the the people who make cut. Like they they think this stuff out very well. Let's drop these moccasins. Oh, we are we are carrying five things. Um, let's drop this kudzu stem. And oh yeah, the raw bear jerky. Let's drop that. Hoping that we didn't get thrown into a portal and we didn't that's nice let's go ahead and uh, treat this as uh whoops 
Let's treat this as scrap and disassemble it. But yeah, um, the, the clam isn't as interesting as time space portals because time space portals can be, they can go anywhere. And anywhere is more interesting than just in Lake Hinnom and Palladium Reef because truth be told, Lake Hinnom and the Palladium Reef are, are still new and they feel um, less developed in, in IMO to than the, the rest of the world, the rest of Cud. Uh, we are an insect right now. That was why I was swapping places with centipedes. Domin domination is broken. Okay. We're getting some nice XP here. We get 150 from those electrical sparks. Um, we took another weird artifact. We should examine these artifacts. Stun rod. Um, let's go ahead and treat these as scrap and disassemble. I have flaming iron mace. Cool. Not really worth it. Electrified bronze dagger. We'll keep that. Carbine. Now that's something. Now that is something. Uh, technically a bows and rifle. Kind of want to disassemble that. And I think I will. I, I know I could sell it. It would be pretty good trade fodder this early in the game but i i don't want to have to deal with it we we have so such low strength our character has so little strength that it's just not worth it um it's not really worth doing the whole like you know collecting things mini game i know i just collected a glow sphere and so therefore i'm kind of a hypocrite but you know what i mean um but you know when, when we can only carry like what is it now 180 pounds which is very little comparatively speaking and i i don't have a i still don't have a backpack i don't know what you want to go backpack backpack you know nation is broken anyway i don't have a backpack we have a sparking betel so I, I can't carry basically anything right now. So what, what, what's your what's your deal? Place five woolly items before me. I shall reward you with a splendid vestment. That's very doable. Hundred percent could do that. Woolly, not a big deal. Not a big deal at all. Um, this is one of those occasions where I wish that I had force bubble. Force bubble, really good. Really good bubble. One of my favorite bubbles, you know? Okay. Um, let's... I guess we could proselytize someone, but that's going to potentially create a problem, but we didn't create a, a space-time vortex, which is great. I'm going to go and spread... Uh, we can't do that while waiting. Stupid amoebas. I hate amoebas. I'm beginning to hate amoebas. I'm pretty sure we're close enough to all oh, slugs now oh, oh we died well i've died more times in this one run than i think in any other game it has been kind of a trial and i'm kind of over it <laughs> i i don't really like this character and they keep dying and i know it's me that's dying but some part of me blames the character like, for real, part of me is like, I, I don't like this character. They, they just keep dying. It's not fun. Um, why? You might wonder, like, why am I still doing this? Why am I still, like, why am I rolling as a character I don't like? Well, because that's kind of the nature of achievement hunting, isn't it? You, you gotta occasionally do a thing that you don't enjoy. Um... And domination, if I can, like, get this character to some kind of passable level, if I can get them to late game, will save me so much time. Um, there, there are quite a few achievements that would, re would require me playing the game multiple times. Do we have precognition? What, what happened to our... I thought we had precognition on this run. 
Am I playing? Am I playing the wrong character?